My friend Eric and I, as well as my sister and her boyfriend, had been hanging out, smoking a few J's at a friend's house on Bicentennial. After having dropped off my sister's boyfriend, Ian, near Trenton Road, I was driving back south while talking to my sister, who was sitting in the passenger seat, and my friend, who was in the back seat of my Chevy Blazer, although leaning forward in between my sister and me. As I was approaching Nolana, there was a red sedan driving in front of me, and we were both going at a steady 35 to 40 miles per hour. However, right before Walmart on Nolana, the guy driving in front of me kept going slowly until he made a complete stop on the road. I was mainly staring at the guy's tail lights while we were driving. But when he made the stop, I wondered what the heck the guy was doing. I looked over at my sister and my friend, and they just stared straight ahead, frozen. Suddenly, the guy in front of me hauled tail, and my sister asked, Oh my God, did you see that? As she started tearing up next to me. My friend yelled, Dude, what the heck was that thing? I asked them what they were talking about. My sister kept yelling at me to drive faster, but I was just confused. As the week went by, and I got the full details about what had happened back there, I got a better picture. Apparently, as we were approaching Walmart, there was this huge dog that looked like a pitch black Great Dane running across the street from east to west across 29th Street. Subsequently, when the red sedan spotted it, it was nearly five feet from the car, so he made a full stop. My sister said the dog stood straight up on two feet and walked slowly in front of both cars as it was staring directly at our blazer. As soon as it crossed to the sidewalk on the other side, it went back on all fours and took off heading west near Ware Road. I personally didn't see the thing, but my friend said it was almost identical to the werewolf in Harry Potter's The Prisoner of Azkaban. Tall, skinny, pitch black, and very fast. I have driven by there a few times but haven't run into it since.